guys. So in this workout, you do you will see some cluster sets. Uh, so we're just going to quickly break down what that is and how you'll interpret that from your program. So when you're reading this on your program, you're going to have kind of three main columns that you need to pay attention to. Um, at the top of one column, it'll say cluster. At the top of the second column, it'll say number of sets. And then in the third column, it'll say reps. So the way you'll interpret that, basically each cluster is comprised of a certain number of sets. Okay? Each set is comprised of a certain number of reps. So the way this would look on a workout program, you would see a certain number of clusters. In this case, you're only seeing one, but you might see anywhere from three to four. Then in this case, we have four sets. Each set is comprised of two reps. So what I would do is I would go ahead and perform two repetitions to complete my first set. After I'm done my first set, I'll go ahead, rest for the designated amount of time, and then go ahead and perform my next two reps to finish my second set. Once again, rest for the designated amount of time, complete your third set, and so forth for your fourth one. Once you've completed all four sets within the cluster, you finish that first set within the cluster, and then you go ahead and rest for the second designated amount of time. So in this case, it's a 10 second rest interval in between sets, and then a three minute interval, or rest interval in between clusters until you've completed the designated number of clusters.